Hello and welcome to another Optimal Control Lectures. Here with me Ziad Snusi. Okay, uh, in this video uh, I am going to show you how to solve an optimal control problem or cost function using a genetic algorithm MATLAB toolbox. Okay, so we'll take an example here. Uh, it's, uh, we'll take a two-dimensional problem, for example, and uh, of course it's a cost function is a function of only one variable and we are interested to find this variable for example as you can see here in this picture uh, it's a two-dimensional problem we have a cost function here uh, cost function here and the control input that we are interested to find uh, the, the, the optimum value which make the cost as minimum as possible if we are considering a minimum control problem uh, it's the same way if it is a maximum control problem we are interested to find this u star this will make j as max as possible okay and we know the optimal control problem we have uh, we, uh, in the field of control we need a plant and we need cost function which is informed this way it's some it's not on it's it's not it's not always a, a one-dimensional problem i mean uh, j is function view it could be function of many control inputs it's, uh, it could be a function of many variables. For example, if it is two variable, you can find the surface like now. If it is x1, x2, and you have some cost function here, for example, j, which is function of x1, x2, you can find such a surface. Okay, and we are going to find this uh, minimum using a control problem techniques. Okay, and we have some constraint. We are not considering constraint in this uh, in this uh, tutorial. Okay, so. We'll take. Uh, we'll go ahead and uh, and make and take this example using MATLAB and solve it. Okay, here we open the MATLAB. I am using a MATLAB 2013, and uh, if we have uh, if we define some x, for example, uh, x goes from uh, minus 20, uh, step size 0.1 to 20, and we make some y some uh, function here of x like this one percenter. Just we need to draw it. Like now, okay. Get it done. So, uh, so if we have this cost function here, and uh, we are we are trying to find uh, the x value here, that will this uh, that will make this function as minimum as possible. So it's around. Uh, let's uh, see. It. It's somewhere here. It's, uh, yeah. It's somewhere that will make as minimum as possible so I think it's around this point okay it's around minus 4 okay let's take let's try to find this uh, solve this optimal control problem using genetic algorithm toolbox uh, in the MATLAB okay first of all you need to find you need to define a cost function here okay just go to uh, to your um, uh, to make uh, a MATLAB function make a new script okay I opened the new script here and now we need to uh, write the script okay so just define a normal function for example y equal to define any name cost for example name okay it's an optional uh, option op this uh, this name is op optional for you and we are trying to find x okay it's function of only one variable just I need to take this y okay and drop it here okay make save this file it will be uh, saved as this one make save okay okay now we need to to open the genetic algorithm toolbox here, you just type GA tool, press enter, okay. We'll find a window like this one, you just make add sign, you must make this, okay, and then cost name. This is the name of our uh, function or cost uh, function or our uh, uh, performance index, okay number of variable it's one variable because we are trying to find only x that will make this cost as minimum as possible and press start okay after a few iteration 
you will find you reach to, uh, the value of x that will make the function as minimum as possible. So it gives x as expected, it's minus 4.01. Okay, if you just make it plot again, it's around minus 4. Okay, so we, we use this genetic algorithm, we find it is very useful technique and it's very quick way. It's, uh, it's depending on the random variable and uh, stochastic approach of finding the op uh, optimization problem and find the optimal value. I hope this video will be helpful for you and see you next time.